Are you guys into gaming? How would it be if you could play interesting games and earn money with them at the same time? Seems impossible, right? Well, your dreams and wishes are about to come true because of certain crypto, which I will introduce to you today. Are you curious? Want to know what this crypto is and how it can make the impossible a reality? Then stay with us until the end and find the answers to your questions. Welcome back to Crypto Diary, where we discuss and simplify everything crypto. And today, we're going to explain something to you about the crypto game known as Gafala. So, let's get straight to the topic. Let's start with the basics. So, do you have any idea what Gafala actually is? Well, let me explain it to you. Actually, Gafala is a mining game with several stages where the characters will be mining for gems and earning Gafala tokens to exchange later on the website for actual crypto tokens. An amazing project, isn't it? So, what about its tokens? A project this amazing is obviously bound to have some amazing tokens, right? Well, the tokens are known as GAFA tokens and can be exchanged in real time. And when talking about the conversation, then it's pretty generous with 1000 GAFALA tokens being equal to one GAFA token. But later on, it can also depend upon the ratio decided. Also, these GAFA tokens are not only for gaming purposes. They are a multifunctional token powered by Binance Smart Chain. So users can experience, create, and enjoy the GAFALA. Abling these tokens to be used for multiple purposes such as paying gas, fees, governance, in-game purchases, and many more. Moreover, the main utility for the token is a play-to-earn mobile game that will be developed within the next three months, suitable for Android and iOS, and that too for free. Now, why don't we take a look at the structure of the game? So here, players can customize their characters and their own in-game NFTs, in which players will be able to exchange and upgrade those NFTs to maximizing their mining so they can earn more when they're away. Additionally, it will also have the first ever API, which will give you flexibility, simplified design, administrative privileges, and provide opportunities for innovation. But the best news is they're also working on a metaverse called Gafaverse, which will be released in less than a year. And its potential is huge for such games, especially when people can see that they are earning as they play an addictive game such as Farmville. So, can you just imagine? From a mining game to the first ever crypto API, then into the GAFA wars. The real power of decentralized application becomes real. Okay, so now if we're talking about the game, then I guess we should know the masterminds behind this mind-blowing NFT project. So the game is designed and developed by the talented team. They call themselves as Team Novas. And when talking about them, there's a very interesting backstory. Just like the story of the world-famous FPS game known as Valorant. I absolutely recommend you guys to listen to the story because it will help you a lot in playing the game. You can almost gain an edge over others if you follow the story and understand it. So let's begin. Now in the year 2065, a research facility on Earth found a rare gem that has never been seen before. After many experiments on the gem, they found that the gem holds a tremendous amount of energy that can change the course of the future. But the research facility has kept the research secret so it would never fall into the wrong hands. The research facility believes that this can be a game changer for the colonization process that is happening on Mars. By this time, Earth was partially inhabitable, and people who could afford the trip to Mars left, and many were left behind on Earth. The research facility built a base on Mars hoping to find the same type of gem they found on their previous home, Earth. After sending many excavation teams to different planets, they found a source on a planet, and they called it Kafala. And that's how, folks, the project was initiated. But there is more lore at the beginning of 2078, the G facility sent out a contract for anyone with a requirement of owning a spaceship and having mechanical skills. And the purpose of this contract was to form an excavation team and send them to Kafala planet. But the information that was available for people was labeled confidential. The other members of the team was an undercover G facility scientist with the task to find the location of the gems underground. It took them four years' journey to reach their destination. The team was made up of two members. Noah Nicholas as a pilot and excavator, Anya Ahur as a researcher and team manager. After their landing, they realized Gafala was not like any other planet they had seen before, because from the looks of the surface, it seemed like a newborn planet covered with hot lava. Like, oh my god, this is one heck of an interesting story, full of unpredictability and curiosity throughout the journey. But surprise! When you think it's the end, it's not actually the end. There's more to it. I guess it has already been mentioned that you will be getting certain characters to play the game, each having different abilities. So it's obvious that these characters also have a full story and past in their own, right? Otherwise, it can't be called as a full-fledged game. Cheer up, guys. 
So are you ready to hear it? Let's see what the characters have for us up in their sleeves. The first character is called Anya Ather, who is a scientist and a researcher. Anya was born on Mars, and she comes from a rich family who were one of the first people to move to Mars. She always wanted to have a job where she could explore outside the walls of their colony, but her family insisted that she must become a scientist and work in a lab for her safety. After all, her curiosity about the outside world cost her an arm. The second character is Noah Nicholas, who is a pilot and mechanic. Noah was born on Earth from a line of family who have only known hard work. His mom passed away when he was just a kid, and he was raised by his uncle and dad. Noah followed his dad's legacy of building spaceships. He taught Noah how spaceships work from inch to inch and how to become a pilot. However, his dream was to fly Noah and his brother to Mars to have a better life, and his dream stayed as such when he got the COVID-68 virus and passed away. Noah decided to dedicate his life to fulfill his dad's dream and take care of his uncle per his dad's wish. Moreover, the G facility manager starts a meeting with his scientist committee and decides that it's time to search for a gem on another planet other than Mars. They have been studying the planet Gafala, and based on their info, there's a large amount of the gem present on the planet. After talking and arguing for hours, they agree to send out a contract and start their mission as soon as possible. So guys, how much did you like the story? Do rate it on a scale of 1 to 10 in the comments section below. Oh wait, the video's not over yet. I bet you're forgetting something, but what? Ah yes, the roadmap. And the coin allocation process of this amazing crypto is still left to be revealed. And it's no surprise, it will be amazing as the project itself. The GAFA token is a project that started in the fourth quarter of 2021. The project is made of multiple aspects. First, to create a crypto token by the name GAFA token. Second, to create an API that will increase functionality for developers so they can integrate it with their systems and make their payment process simple. Third, to develop a P2E game by the name Gafala that will work in synergy with the other aspects of the game. There are other potential long-term goals that are worth mentioning. The Gafaverse is an open place that will be based on the planet Mars and virtual world that will be a hub for gamers. Furthermore, there will be a market for NFTs. Now coming back to coin allocation, let's check out how it is going to be. 25% are locked, 20% will be unlocked and are dedicated to the P2E game once it's launched. 10% for the team, 40.45% will be on pre-sale and pink sale will automatically lock 60%. 4% is dedicated to the GAFA Charity Foundation. 0.55% will be left as a puzzle. Now that we've come to the end of the video, let us thank you all for staying with us until the end. Don't forget to let us know in the comments section what are your views regarding the GAFALA and the GAFA tokens, and if you're willing to play the game. Okay, that's it for today. Hope you liked our video. Stay tuned for our next interesting video, and we assure you, you will not be disappointed. If you got to learn something new, leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. And we'll see you in the next video.